Hello everyone, I'm Barkley Hunter, lead programmer for the Brooks High School Robotics team, and this is the first episode of a four-part MATLAB and Simulink tutorial that I'll be releasing over the course of the summer in preparation for the upcoming season of Best Robotics. In this first part, we're going to run through the process of installing MATLAB on your computer and setting up the VEX library that you'll use to program your competition robot. Before beginning this tutorial, your team sponsor will need to submit a request to MathWorks, the company that makes MATLAB. You should have received an email from your local hub containing a link to the request form. If you have not received this email, the request can also be accessed from the MathWorks Best Robotics page. A link to this page will be in the description below the video. Once their request is approved, your license number and activation key will come to your team sponsor via another email. Have them forward this email to you, and then you're ready to begin installation. This is the MathWorks homepage. Here you need to create or log in to your MathWorks account. There will be a link to this website also in the description. Once you've logged in to your account, you should be sent to a page that looks like this. Select View My Licenses under My Licenses. This will bring you to your license center. If you have any other active licenses, you will see them here. Click the Associate License button to continue. Follow the on-screen instructions and use the license number you received, when prompted, to associate the license with your account. Once the license has been associated, click Download Your Products Now on the Success screen. Select to download the newest release available. At this time, the newest release version is R2016A. Here, choose the correct installer for your computer's operating system. If your computer asks you whether to run or save the installer, select to save it. If there is not an option to save, click to run instead. If you are required to save the installer, the next step is to find it in your downloads or wherever you saved it and run it from there. When the installer starts, it will ask you to select an installation method. Choose to log in with your MathWorks account. Make sure you have an internet connection before you do this. Accept the terms and agreements when you're prompted. And now re-enter your login information from your MathWorks account. Select the correct license to install. It should be labeled with the current year and best robotics. Choose where to install the MATLAB files. The default on Windows is the program files folder. Make sure to download all of the products offered. Select to create a desktop shortcut to MATLAB. You never know when you may need to pull it up on short notice to make a change to the robot's programming. If everything looks correct on this screen, then you're ready to install. The download and installation process can take quite a while, possibly even an hour or more. This depends heavily on your local internet speed. Once installation is complete, you may get a screen similar to this one. Simply press next to continue. Once you reach this screen, make sure the Activate MATLAB box is selected and press Next. Proceed through the next screens following the given information. Select to finish once activation succeeds. There's no need to open MATLAB yet. To successfully install the VEX library, you need to run MATLAB as an administrator. To do this on a Windows platform, right click on your desktop shortcut. You can select the Run as Administrator option but you have to do this every time the program is opened. It's much easier to set it to run as administrator by default. To do this, right click the shortcut and select properties. In properties, go to the compatibility tab and select run this program as administrator. Click apply and press OK. Now the VEX library needs to be downloaded. This is done from MathWorks website. A link to this page will also be in the description below. Once you're there, select get support package. Once it is downloaded, find it in your files. Right click on it, select open with, and open it with the version of MATLAB you just installed. At this point, MATLAB will open. This may take a few minutes. Once it opens, continue to wait until the support package installer automatically starts. Make sure the install option is checked for the ARM Cortex-based VEX microcontroller, as you can see here. Once again, log into your MathWorks account. Accept the terms and conditions again, and when presented with this window, check to see that the listed programs are the same as those shown here. Then select Next. Press Install. 
The download and installation process will begin and may take several minutes. It will proceed through several different download screens as it goes. Once the installation is complete, press finish. An examples page may open. We'll cover many of these examples later in the series, but feel free to get acquainted with them on your own as well. To check that the VEX library is properly installed, select the Apps tab at the top of the screen. There should be an app labeled VEX Companion. Click the VEX Companion app, and this page should pop up within a few moments. If it does, then you've successfully completed the installation. I hope you found this MATLAB installation guide to be helpful in preparing the program on your computer. In the next episode, we will look at the basics of Simulink programming and the VEX library. Stay tuned, and goodbye.